to another episode of Watch Mine Silver. My name is Big E. Today we're going to be looking at this Seiko Alpinus, and this is the SPB155, and this has a $725 suggested retail price. And the movement in here is a 6R35. Now, someone posed a question to me if you were going to buy one watch under a thousand dollars, a do-it-all watch. I said there's only one choice in the Seiko playbook that I would suggest, and it's this Seiko Alpinus. Not the one with the internal rotating bezel, because in my mind, that might be a little too um, niche and too sporty. This one flies under the radar, um, but it's still a great sports watch. Now, Let's take a look at the measurements. Before I do that, you can pick this watch up at azfinetime.com. They are in stock. And they have all the colorways in these Alpinists. And they have um, both sizes. The uh, one with the inner rotating bezel and with the dual crowns. Or this one that I like the best with the single crown. Now, this watch is... Let's check it out real quick. 38 millimeters by... About 13 millimeters thick, and then a lug to lug is just going to be about a 46. That is great dimensions for just about anybody's wrist. And I'll try this on my wrist, which is 7.25 inches. And that's what it looks like. Beautiful, classic 38 millimeter watch, smooth bezel. And this watch will compete with watches um, like a Rolex Explore uh, 39. I know this is 38, it's a little smaller, but it still wears nice because of the way the watch and the case is. Now you get a full polished uh, case on the sides. You get a polished bezel on here, a tool-like brush, Twin trigger deployant milled class bracelet. And this bracelet is fixed with pins and sleeves. And that gives you a little bit more high security because with screws, sometimes they can back out with the pins and sleeves. You don't have to worry about that. Now, this watch is a do it all watch because you do have a full, zoom in on the dial a little bit, 200 meters of water resistance. You get a screw down crown, a beautiful um, Fume type uh, pebble dial. You see the texture dial on there? You get real nice um, applied Seiko sign. And then all the numbers look like that they are um, maybe embossed on there. You get a beautiful set of. Uh, gold gilt cathedral hands and a cathedral red tipped second hand that reaches all the way out to the seconds track this watch does have lumi bright on the second hand the hour and a minute hand and also at each indice in a white surround on the date box with a black wheel and white printing all of this is done up excellent Seiko fashion, automatic Prospects X, right over 6 o'clock. And this watch is just something that you're going to use on an everyday basis. Now, you do get a 6R35 modern movement, 21,600 vibrations an hour. And this watch gives you a full 70 hours of autonomy. This watch is a strap monster. And as you can see, you do get, with the movement, some Tokyo striping on there. So that's always good to see when you get a little bit of movement. Now this has a um, dome sapphire crystal with anti-reflective coating on the inside. Man, I just like this watch. 
and the 38 millimeter size is just perfection. Now let's look at the loom on this one. I'll charge it up. And this is going to have a cyan blue type loomy bright. And that loom lasts all night, especially on the hands because you have more real estate. And it's just a good looker. That's what it looks like in full dark. Beautiful blue loomy bright. And once again, you can pick this up. It's in stock at azfinetime.com. And this is the green fume type dial on here that starts with ivory league green in the middle and fades out around the rim by the numbers to a nice super dark green black. And with this texture dial, this looks lovely. So anyway, you can pick this up at azfinetime.com. This is my entry for best everyday watch under a thousand bucks. My name is Biggie. That's the watch once over for today. I'll catch you guys on the next one. God bless.